Hello, life creators. Whenever we hear negative words directed toward us, let's not let them land inside of us. We must know enough to not let those words in because they will fester and they will eat away at our souls. Very hard to do. We are not losers. We are not stupid or whatever people may say about us. Let's think about all the things we excel in. And when we set our mind to it, we know how to dedicate ourselves to our family, our friends, our work or our careers, our dreams and our community and our country and our earth. And sometimes things don't work out for us. We lose things, maybe our marriage, maybe our kids, maybe our parents, maybe our home, maybe our jobs, maybe our health, maybe our freedom. And we've all been a little downhearted, very downhearted with what's going on in the world now. It's very frightening on what we can lose and what we have lost. And maybe we allow bad things to happen in our lives because we make poor cho choices. Maybe we didn't say no when we should have. Maybe we didn't see our own value at the time. Maybe we didn't listen to our own inner voice. Maybe we didn't speak our truth. Maybe we didn't defend ourselves. Maybe we didn't protect ourselves. Let's let this realization, that's why I'm talking about this, put a fire underneath us. Let's decide to really get back to our own beliefs, our own ideas, our own inner desires, because when we focus on what we want to do, what we love, what is beautiful, what our dreams are, what we believe in, we always do better. We make better decisions with our own knowledge, our own wisdom, and based on our own common sense. Open our eyes and see. Let's tell ourselves the truth, which is we are able, we are strong, we are smart, we have tools and skills, we can learn, we can figure things out, we can do anything we put our mind, our heart, our soul into. Wherever we put our energy, it will blossom. Wherever you water, like in a garden, it will grow. Whatever you tend will blossom. Your words, even the words you put out will not return to you void. They will produce something. So let's not worry about our doubts, our fears, imposter syndrome. Don't worry about what they will say. They are totally imaginary beings, like Napoleon Hill said so many years ago what they will say, who will judge you. Let's not worry about them. What is everybody else doing? Let's think about what are the things we value? What are our passions? Let's find mentors, coaches, friends, family who will help us. Let's learn from people who came before us. Let's read, let's learn about what we want to do, what we want to achieve. Let's listen to voices of value and we can empower others. We can inspire others. That's what I'm hoping to do with this channel is to encourage others, uplift others, give people hope so that everyone can blossom. Because when we, you know, all of us need all of us. Let's give courage to people. Let's all go toward our goals and our dreams. Let's not sabotage ourselves or other people, but let's not hold ourselves back. Let's not stand in our own way. Some people throw away their happiness with both hands. Sometimes we lash out and we hurt people we love because we're afraid of something deep down. Maybe they hurt, up, hurt us because they are afraid of something deep down. But let's have the courage and the willingness to take new actions because if we keep doing the same things that have brought us hurt in the past or poor results, we're going to get the same outcomes. If we keep putting up with what we don't like, we're going to get the same results and the same treatment. Let's take new actions and let's have new reactions because we are worth it. We matter. It's a new day. We're a new person. We reinvent ourselves each day. Like they say, yourselves reinvent each day. Well, we're different people each day. 
So please, if you have found value, press the like button, press share so others can feel inspiration. Check out my other videos on my channel and I will see you in the next one.